Why are you filming me? Oh, walking right up to me. This is a private property you can't record. Oh, sure I can. From out here I can. Alright, well, I'm going to be in with the cops. Hello there, welcome to this installment of First Amendment Rights. Today I'll be checking out this government contracted facility doing a First Amendment audit from the public easement today. Check my right to record, got a photo and video to respect it. Hopefully it is. Stay tuned, we'll see how things go. We got someone already out here. get into at the moment. And you are? Hi. Why are you filming me? Oh, you're walking right up to me. Okay, because you have a camera. Okay. In front of our building. That's what they're made to do. And what's the reason for? Oh, like I said, I'm not going to discuss that. That's all, that all I'll say is that I'm investigating your company right now. Have a good morning. So she claimed I was recording in front of their company when I'm actually across the street here. <laughs> so not even close to recording in front of their building. We are in the middle of uh, this industrial part of town here. It's a nice, clear, sunny morning. Not too hot, not too cool either. Perfect weather for getting out and doing some public documenting today. Since this is a government contracted facility, I'll be placing the uh, dollar amount, number of contracts, as well as their industry classification in the uh, captions below in today's video, as I typically do with these type of locations. All right, taking notice of their uh, cameras mounted outside, the exterior of their building pointed in various directions, so they are actually uh, doing their fair share of recording, as well as I am today, from the public easement. I did get a little closer, but I am still along the street here, right along the street, hugging the side. So their windows are pretty heavily tinted. Can't really see much inside, except uh, reflection out here. So they're doing their best to create their privacy. Nice to not be able to see much of uh, what's going on in, in the building. Looks like the front door is uh, slightly open. It's cracked open, looks like someone's going to be peeking out. There's the handle. It's bumped open a second ago. The door cracked open, just got a cam back there, and they just shut it. I got someone crossing the street approaching over to my right here. Stand by, guys, we'll see what happens. Good morning. Hi. I'm just curious as to why you were filming our property. Oh, well, I already told the other lady. Oh, okay, but I'm not associated with them. Oh, okay. We're, we're over there. Well, I wasn't even focused on your property. Okay. But okay. Do you mind if I ask what, why you're filming? Sure do, yeah. Oh, you mind? Yeah, I mind. Okay, so you don't want to offer that information? Not at this time, no. Okay, good enough. Thank you. Yeah, have a good day. Stay cool. Don't work too hard. So he came over from the uh, business behind there, behind the gate. Which I was kind of surprised. Or set back a little further there. But uh, I told him I didn't care to give him any information. He accepted it. So there he goes, back inside. Right behind a double layer of fencing there. So he's going back to whatever he's doing. I'm here, I might as 
well check out and see what they got going on behind their gates. It's like a lot of uh, traffic uh, barricades, signage for uh, road work construction. Got quite a bit of equipment back here. And since this other business was set back further, I'm going to take a wild guess that this is probably a camera mounted to the corner. That's what they took notice of me on because I honestly didn't see anybody uh, walking around out there on the back property. And then again, they are set back pretty far. Alright guys, I'm going to go ahead and uh, move along down the street and check out some of the other businesses in the area. Alright guys, moving along down to the next uh, location. It's like uh, some kind of work yard going on here. We got someone out here. Take a notice of my uh, presence out here on the sidewalk. I'm just outside their property gate. Okay, so we got a couple individuals out here. they got going on. So we got a couple more people from the office over here looking out this way. We're taking notice. Looks like I got someone maybe approaching. Stand by, guys. How's it going? Hi there. Hey, what are you recording? Oh, just the business right now. What is it? No, I'm just recording the facility right now. Oh, are you with insurance or something? Insurance? No. Who are you with? Well, I'm just here with myself today. Oh, uh, what happened? Well, I don't know. Nothing happened, really. <laughs> Mark Wynn, Diversified Asphalt Products. Cool, hi, nice to meet you. So what are you videotaping for? Oh, just working on a video right now. For? I can't discuss that. Oh, really? Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, for sure. Have a good day. Thank you uh, for flying the flag up high over there. I appreciate it. What's going on? We've had that since day one. Nice. Very cool. And it's lit up at night. Awesome. Fantastic. Very good to know. Yeah, that's the flag I was mentioning, blowing high in the wind. So they are... Uh, Respectful of our nation's flag, properly lighting it up at night, as he said. So he was uh, cordial enough, just curious, took my picture as it's his right to do. Give him a peace sign there. Hi. How's it going? Good, how can I help you? Oh, I didn't need any help. I'm good, thanks. What are you doing? Oh, I'm just taking some video right now. This is a private property. Oh, I know what that is, yeah. Well, you're staring under my camera, right? Guard. Oh, but I'm standing on public property. This is a private property you can't record. Oh, sure I can. From out here I can. Alright, well, I'm going to be in with all the cops. Oh, I mean, you're going to waste their time, but okay. Well, I'd rather waste my time to make sure it's... No, you're going to waste their time, because they'll tell you what I'm doing is perfectly legal. Have a good morning. Tell them I said hi. This guy's going to ruin it for him. Threatening to call the police. He did mention that that is their private property, and I'm respectful of that. I am standing just outside of that private property line on the public sidewalk. Doing my documenting. Being respectful of their boundary lines. The two ladies still out here. I went back inside. Alright, so now they're shutting their doors. Creating their privacy, doing what they need to do. So that's good on them for that. But I will 
be out here for just a while longer, just in case if there is any sign that uh, law enforcement might show up, I'll be here for sure to document them if and when they arrive. the chain link fence. He's still on his phone. He is on the phone with law enforcement. Hopefully he's getting uh, an education about public photography there. The first guy didn't seem to have an issue, but this guy pulled up pretty hot, wanting to know what I'm doing. Another park in this car in here, back in this vehicle in to block my view as best they can. Not without much effort. It must be pretty secretive on what they got going on in there. for a little while. It's been about 10 minutes. Still waiting on uh, law enforcement if they're going to show up. Most likely they probably just educated him, but cover my bases. So I'm going to be waiting out here for about another 15 or so. Stand by for another update. Looks like the first individual that spoke with me is speaking to the other guy now. We're blocking a third truck there. <laughs> They're going the extra mile there to create their privacy. Putting a whole fleet of vehicles out here <laughs> to prevent any uh, view there. This guy's on his phone. better vantage point. No law enforcement heading down this way. And there's none down this way. So I'll still be out here for just a little while longer to do some more documenting. Stand by guys. Uh, from 
sometimes wonder, uh, what did the police say? Hey, what did the cops say? Are they coming? Oh, he retreated back inside. Anyways, as I was saying, uh, I wonder if oftentimes if any of these locations ever realize that uh, you can get a far better aerial view from Google Earth. see their entire property from the inside. Far better than any of my cameras could ever get. So I'm going to head back over to the corner. So if there's any law enforcement around there. Get a better vantage point from over there actually. I'll cover all angles that way. Stand by guys. Yeah, this guy's trying to get into the property but he might be Blocked obviously because their vehicles are blocking the driveway. There's the guy that called the cops earlier. I'm down at the corner. I haven't seen any law enforcement on either side. They just backed up the vehicles to let him through, so he's gone in. Made way for the oncoming vehicles to go into the property. So it looks like the, uh, I guess he might be the owner or upper management. He's still on his phone there for a moment. Retreated back inside. Right, guys I haven't seen any law enforcement in the vicinity it doesn't look like they're gonna be showing up I most likely educated him over the phone today I'm gonna go ahead and close their gates to create the privacy block their vehicles in the driveway to prevent any view as best they can so they did what they had to do first couple of locations I went to they had some curiosity but they left it at that so you know I'll uh, go ahead and give the second location here a fail since they threatened to call police, but uh, hopefully they got educated with whoever they talked to on the phone. Got a little enlightenment today. That's too bad because uh, they're flying the flag high over there. One would assume that they really uh, respect uh, others' individual freedoms out in public. Uh, threatening to call the police, that's a shame. So thanks for watching guys. Be sure to subscribe to First Amendment Rights on YouTube, like and share the videos. Greatly appreciate it. You can also follow First Amendment Rights on Facebook and Instagram. Again, thanks for watching. See you next time. Hope you have a great day wherever you're at. Take care. Till then. Bye now.